We're out moving the yearlings this morning with Stoney. One of the reasons we like to move them in the morning, for one, it's, it's a lot cooler so the cattle move quickly without the stress of the heat. And also we feel that it's a little harder for the flies to keep up with them. Or he's gonna pick up this bull. Come by. I kind of stopped and I'm sitting in the back. Bring him now. So he's a little bit confused as to what I'm doing. He's used to me taking the lead most of the time. Good boy, bring him now. Which I really should get up and take the lead here pretty quick. So I moved on up ahead here. Had to get around this gully with the side by side, but the cattle should be able to cross pretty easily. He's gonna move up to the lead here. Get him turned downhill towards me. He might not be completely sure where I'm at, so I might holler out. Get back! Get back and bring him. Oh, he's got it. See if he swings all the way around and picks up those on the left. Not yet. There he goes. Sorry, the video is really blurry. A lot of my moves in the summer are early morning. Here they come. And he's a long ways out there. I'm zoomed in quite a bit. Cattle should be able to find a pretty good dropping spot. It's feeling frisky when it's cool in the morning. When they can go downhill, they like to kick up their heels. Come on, get ahead! If anything, we want him to drift off to the right a little bit. We'll let him pick him up over here. You can see the banks are a little steep down in there. Some of them are going to cross just fine. They're even enjoying the grass down in there. We're going to have him take him a little bit farther off to the right. I think there's a better crossing near the wall of that old dam. Here we are up on the wall of this washed out dam. This was the old overflow. It should be able to cross right down in there pretty good, or especially on my side coming up the bank. So if he keeps him drifting this way, it shouldn't be too much of a problem. We're gonna bring Stony around to kind of block here. <clears throat> oh, he's come by, Stony. Come, come by. He was already circling was in all the way around to the other side. Not sure if he was uh, real sure of where I was. Stony, come. There he goes. I'm just trying to lose trouble crossing that gully. Here. We've got him moving up too high on the wall. If we could get him to cross right back in here, it would be ideal. Stoney, come, come! Good boy. Here, walk up now. Come. There. Da! Okay. 
Down the bank then. Walk out. We're gonna have him come down the bank next. But there, there. Good. Look back. Look back. He wasn't going to be able to climb that wall up the same way he'd come down. Good boy, Stoney. Well, they're crossing good. Stoney, come! Come! Going to have him pressure up on top just a little bit, and then he's going to have to drop back down and block real quick. Come! Come! Good boy. Come, good, right there. These, these yearlings are climbing pretty good. There. <clears throat> come, Stony, come, come. There. Walk up. There. Oh, we. Well, he can make it up. So much handier than trying to cover that same ground with a four wheeler. Be impossible. Good boy, bring him on now. Stone. Stoney, come. There. Oh, we. There. Walk up, walk up, walk up, walk up, walk up. Oh, we. Good boy. Bring him. I'm going to try to move down in there, give you an idea of just how steep that is. Good. Bring him now. There, walk up. There, come on, come right there. Walk up there, away there. Walk, walk up. Good, that's the last of them. Walk up. Sun has just come up. So this was one of our longer moves. I let Stoney work for the first half, and now I'm going to go get some more help for him. Getting him put through this gate right here. What I ended up doing, bringing just one young dog along. Get back. It's bear. Get back. Get back. Good boy, bear. There, down, down. Get ahead, get ahead, get ahead. Then I brought Annie along also. I've got to move up and take the lead here real quick. These cattle are not wanting to turn right now. Get ahead! I'm supposed to come down the draw towards me. I'm gonna have Annie up there in just a moment. She's at the lead. There she is. She's got, got him turning now. Stoney's right behind her and then Bear. A bear might come charging all the way up. Oh, he turned back. He's starting to figure it out pretty good now. Just getting at that golden hour in the morning. Bear, get back! Get back! Good boy! Bring him on! Get back! Ah! Get back! Good! Bring him! 
We've got Annie and Stoney are up on the edge again. They already knew who the stragglers were. Bring them on now. now I've got to take the lead. This bear is going to try to take it if I don't. They're headed right just right now. They want to take this straw down. Let's see if I can get Bear to get back one more time. Oh, he might do it all on his own. There he goes. Oh, not far enough. There, get back. Get back. Get back. Now he's got it. That's Bear. Stoney and Annie. Oh, bear just fell in that gully. Good dogs. Bring them on now. I better take the lead quick. So now I've moved over to the other side of the yearlings here. Still coming down that same draw just right. Right about here, we're going to head up this draw. When I'm training these younger dogs, it's a little bit hard to video sometimes because we got to get out and correct them and get them working right. I think Bear's pretty well got it figured out. Here he's moving up. Get back. Get back. Good. Bring him on. Yeah, he's doing real good. Move just a little further up the draw. We're just reaching the point we need him to turn. Come right up here. Dogs should naturally balance and bring them towards me, but sometimes I gotta give a little more encouragement to really get them to turn. Annie, get ahead! Good, Stoney. Get back now. Good. They're turning pretty decent now. Good boy, Bear. Bring them on! Turned them just a little too far. Part of that, they're trying to come up the hill straight to me. If I would just take the lead, we would have been all right. So that's what I'm gonna do. Bring him, Stone. Oh, they're coming good. There! Get back! Good dogs. And again, they keep me busy moving up to the lead. Well, I'd try to video just a little bit while I'm, what it looks like when I'm driving in the lead. Some of you who watch my videos will recognize this place. If you watch the video of cows in the stackyard, we've got to put these yearlings through under this fence here. We've got to get it lifted up in the air for them. It's not easy to do with one hand. 
All right, got it up in the air there, and we're gonna close this gate. Yeah, don't want them in the stack yard again. I'm gonna attempt to video it from this angle. This is gonna be a little tougher. Get ahead, get ahead. I'm gonna be relying on the dogs to turn them towards me, and then they've gotta do a right angle turn away from me. Stony, away. Whoosh. Here, get ahead, get ahead. Here, get ahead. The bear was in the right spot. We're just bringing Annie and Stoney up. Watch, watch. Watch, push, push, push. You can see we've got some leaders going in. What can make this difficult, once those leaders go in, the ones on the outside will try to follow them from the outside. So we've got to make those, keep those dogs covering and blocking them to come in Come in here and do this U-turn. Bring them on. Your dogs. So we'll... Come, 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 come. There. Bear, cam. Bear, there, down, down. The bear is in just the right spot if he would stay there. Because he's going to keep him from flowing out that way. And I've got Stony right there, Annie right there covering. There, down. The bear doesn't have a lot of patience. So we're not going to force him too long. There, down ah, down okay he's down good so we're gonna let him up now bring him bear push push i just gotta there. say that was disappointing i thought i was videoing for that last bit and i must have bumped it off yearlings are through it was a pretty neat finish i guess i can point out where they can go to so we've got this backyard they're at the water tank right now they can go out through oop to a gate right here and out in where the trees are all the way back up on that hilltop even there's another water tank at the other end if you've watched the video annie gathering in the creek pasture that's the pasture they're going to be in right now another part of moving the cattle is moving the their lick tubs and, and mineral tires fence chargers We've got bag mineral sitting in here. We gotta go set the chargers up in the new spot and put some mineral out for him. Annie, good girl, load up. Yeah, you get the high spot today. 